Okay, I'm going to show you how to create your own web portfolio using iPhoto and iWeb. Um, so this is a part two thing. So you've already created your um, iPhoto things. So if you haven't done that, you'll need to go back one tutorial. But uh, we're going to launch iWeb first. So we'll go to the Finder, go to Applications, and choose iWeb to open that up. When you first open up, it'll ask you if you want to do your mobile me stuff. Uh, just click no thanks unless you have a mobile me account. Um, and then in here it'll ask you to choose a template. So choose from your templates. I'll just choose this one and click choose. And then on here it, I want you to just do the about me uh, page on there. Uh, if you didn't quite see that, um, that was uh, this one right here. So uh, we'll do about me, don't do the welcome one. So once you have that, I want you to get a picture of yourself in there. Uh, if you don't have a picture, go to photos and you might have one in photo booth that you can just drag over of yourself, put it into whatever spot you want it to go to. Uh, to adjust it, you just double click on it and you can kind of play with the mask and then position it to where you want it to go and then click off of it. Um, if you don't have, if you want to just take a picture real quick, um, go over to widgets, drag over eyesight photo, and go ahead and capture a photo of you really quick. And click off of it. So fill out this information, do a little biography about yourself. You'll definitely want to uh, type out some text about yourself too up in the top make it look professional so this is where you'll type out double click to just start typing out your biography about yourself and make it sound good you're trying to sell um, yourself and basically show people why they should choose you or just talk about yourself on there once you get that part done then we want to do the portfolio side of things where you insert your um, your Photoshop and Illustrator uh, portfolio. So go to File and New Page. And I would choose from the same uh, area that you've been working with, the same uh, look. Otherwise, it might look like somebody threw up on your uh, portfolio. So we'll go to My Albums because we want to add some albums. And eventually, you'll want to change this up to and tailor it towards yourself. Uh, go to Photos and you'll have your albums in here. So if you go to Photoshop and drag that on top here. That'll generate your Photoshop gallery. Click back on albums up here. Go to Illustrator and drag that in here as well and it'll generate that page for you. So uh, that should give you your album pages uh, and your different galleries. Now if you don't have your um, if you don't have a title thing on there yet you'll need to go back into iPhoto and create that and just drag it toward make sure it's the very top one up there so you can create that inside of Photoshop um, on there same thing make sure there's a title for Photoshop uh, on there so if you have some other stuff like maybe I want to do a gallery of my digital pictures you're welcome to do that too um, make it tailored towards yourself get rid of text you don't need little icons you don't need up along the top or whatever one you pick those will eventually become buttons when we publish it uh, but that's how you create your your gallery um, and we'll export this to uh, an HTML document where it'll become a web page gallery that we can burn onto a CD or upload onto the web